And we go green in New York City. Season 5 of the ABB Formula E Championship saw Jean-Éric Verne secure his second consecutive driver's title. And he is a two times Formula E champion. Eight months of hard-fought races on city street circuits around the globe came right down to the wire in New York City. Fans have delighted in the wheel-to-wheel -wheel action. For manufacturers, it's been about showing the world just what electric cars can do. These cars don't have limitations in terms of range, don't have limitations in terms of performance. We, we're going to be part of this transition from combustion to electrification. I think this is proving to people that um, you can be emotional, you can be passionate about uh, electric vehicles because everything that we know and love about the about combustion cars, actually electric cars deliver all of that and, and more. And season five of the ABB FIA Formula E Championship has shown just that. Top speeds of 280 kilometers an hour, and cars going full race distance on just one charge. I think our role, like you say, is to show that the technology is working, that it keeps on improving. Uh, to the point where people hopefully get, uh, you know, just go out there and decide to buy an electric vehicle because it just they can see that the technology is there, it will fit their needs. And this season, making the link between the track and the consumer market has been the Jaguar I-PACE e-Trophy series running alongside the e-Prix. The 2019 World Car of the Year combining with ABB fast charger technology to put on its own electrifying show. Growing confidence in EV performance, range and in charging infrastructure has seen sales of electric cars soar. Around 2 million EVs were sold in 2018, double the number registered the year before. Over half of those were sold in China. In the first month of 2019, uh, we've also witnessed uh, that this uh, pace of sales uh, keeps, uh, keeps growing. Um, and there's uh, about 2-3% to 3 uh, market share of electric cars uh, today uh, globally. Obviously publicly accessible charging infrastructure deployment will be extremely important to also develop uh, going forward and the deployment of uh, highway charging infrastructure, fast charging infrastructure along highways uh, will also be instrumental to enable uh, long distance EV driving. A leader in the field of charger technology ABB has sold more than 11,000 DC fast chargers across 76 countries worldwide. And connecting these to renewable energy sources edges the EV industry closer to the aspiration of cutting out emissions entirely. If we have the right cars in place, if we have the right charging equipment in place and have enforced the grid, then the fourth parameter is really to go on renewable energy. And if we have this all in place, it's not just fun to ride electric, but it's also the right thing for, for our planet to do it with less fossil fuels and cleaner air. Season 6 of the ABB Formula E Championship will continue to showcase the benefits of sustainable transport to audiences worldwide, while guaranteeing more thrills and spills in the world's fastest all-electric race series along the way.